Good afternoon. This is Lauren Breland with the pleasure of speaking with Jay Wilson from Melanated Moms. And of course, we're still here at the Moby 2019 Symposium. Now, I want to get into Melanated Moms in a moment, but more importantly, I want to talk to this young lady about how to network and negotiate a room because I have seen her doing nothing more than exchanging with at least one quarter of the people here today with information and dialogue. So let's get into it. What is networking to you? Um, networking is cultivating new relationships. It's um, building who you are and finding out how to align yourself with people who have the same type of businesses that you do um, or who can enhance your business perspective. So what is your what is what is your approach to networking? My approach to networking is being um, being the person that you need for the other person. Like kind of like showing them a mirror, you know? So whenever I network with someone, I tell them this is what my business is. Is there a way that we can work together? Or is there a way that you can align me with someone else who will understand the work that I'm doing that can help elevate what I'm doing and you at the same time? What are some of the soft skills and some of the hard skills you need to be an effective networker? Um, soft skill, I would say um, just being approachable, smiling, just like having people understand that you are warm and you are inviting. Mm -hmm. So that makes people want to network with you, yeah. you know, just okay. making eye contact across the room uh -huh. and saying like, you know, like, that's how you came up to me. Yeah. Like, girl, <laughs> listen, I need you to, I'm like, okay, no yeah. problem. Yeah. You know, yeah. um, I think the hard skill is like having your focus okay. and knowing what it is that you're trying to, I don't want to say sell, but like yeah. what it is that you're trying to convey to the other person. So it captivates them to want to learn more about who you are and look into you. Okay. So that's a hard skill. Now, my last question on networking before we move into Melanated Moms yeah. is, how important is it to what you do? How important is networking? Networking. It's everything. It's literally how you grow your business. If you're not able to network, you, you have no business. You have a hobby. Understood. Absolutely. Now, tell me about Melanated Moms. All right. Mm -mm. So, Melanated Moms is a community-based membership. It is... Um, specifically catered to moms and women of color. I'm an event curator. Um, I host different events for um, social engagements with and without our children. I'm also a self-sufficiency coach, and I'm traditionally a nurse by trade. Okay. Where are you located, or where is this focused right now? So I specifically am focused in the state of New Jersey. I won't say one particular county, because I literally, wherever I can drive, I go. Um, but since I started Melanated Moms in 2018, I have cultivated a relationship with women all throughout the Northeast. So I've hosted events all the way from the DMV area all the way up to Toronto. Okay. All right. And what is its target? What is the, what is, what does Melanated Moms want to do for Melanated Moms? Yes, everything. Um, Melanated Moms wants to create a community around any type of woman who feels that she needs support. Okay. So if that support is, um, creating wonderful relationships, going for a promotion, finding out if she can go into entrepreneurship, eliminating barriers, um, finding just that empowerment in herself and self-identity, that's what we're here for. So it's it's kind of like a mentorship. It, definitely. And then, but then also like a coaching. Very much a coaching. So I'm, I'm definitely, I'm leading the coaching and self-sufficiency. I'm showing women that you are you are able to empower yourself and you don't have to be limited by any of the barriers of motherhood, sisterhood, or womanhood that society places on you. And you can elevate yourself to the next level with all the women that are around you as long as you have a great community. And that's what we provide with Melanated Moms. Okay. All right. Is there anything that you would like to when you look into the, into the camera and let moms know just maybe one or two gems. All right. Drop them two gems. Two gems. Okay. My first gem is um, having your own self-identity outside of motherhood is not only needed, it's welcomed. You have women who will stand behind you 
and they will push you in the right direction and they will help you with your children in tow, you know? Um, second thing is my model that I personally say whenever I talk about Melanated Moms, if you're gonna create a business, you have to um, incorporate your kids into the business plan. There should never be a situation where you wanna go into entrepreneurship or any type of venture mm -hmm, mm -hmm. as a mom mm -hmm. and you don't include your children. Your mm -hmm. child should not be the exception. Your child should, should be a part of your negotiation skill. So just as well as you're able to ask for more money, you're able to ask for a promotion, you're able to say like, I need that, I wanna be in that C-suite office. Yeah. I want them to know, yeah, I'm gonna be in that C-suite office. When my kids have to have, they have to have a, a mom, they have to be comfortable too. They're a part of the negotiation. I think that that's wonderful. And is there anything that you personally wanna just say? Yeah. Based on what you, uh, what's occurred for you here today at Moby, what oh. has Moby, offered or shown or what did you get out of this symposium today? Um, confirmation. Um, being in this space, meeting all these wonderful people, actually seeing people that I've networked with before and them recognizing me like, oh my God, yes, da, da. like it was confirmation that this is where I'm supposed to be, this is the work that I'm supposed to be doing, right. this is the conversations I need to have, these are the people I need to be around yeah. and this is this is what literally is cultivating the, the community that I'm creating. And it's great to know that it's people that look like me who want me to succeed too, and they're they're willing to help me as I'm still in, still um, building, right. you know. So it's just it feels good. Okay, this is the best place to be, and I got a free ticket. Thank you. I I wanted to also I I didn't get to see him. Um, uh, Lanier um, Robinson, I think. Um, well, we will find out if he's still here. Yes, because he um, I actually um. I, um, we're connected on LinkedIn mm -hmm. and he put a post and he's like, oh, I have, I have like one or two tickets left. If anybody is interested, please inbox me. And I was like, I'm interested. I'll go. Yeah. So I'm so glad that I did. And I'm so thankful for the opportunity. And I really wanted to thank him. <laughs> because All right. Well, I will check and see if he's here because I was checking in for, for some of the names you got past me. Okay. But if he's here and then still here, yes. I will help you find And him. I will hug him because this was like the most valuable thing I could have ever asked for. And I didn't even know I asked for this. Much you know? love and blessings. Thank you. I'm glad. And so thank you for stopping by and Absolutely. chatting with us at DP TV. Yes. And uh, please look forward to uh, being able to download this app. Absolutely. Please follow me on social media. Check out my website, melanatedmoms.com. Right. The information is? Melanatedmoms.com. All right. Um, all of social media, Instagram, Facebook, and um, Twitter. Melanated Moms, M-E-L-I-N-A-T-E-D-M-O-M-S, all one word. Thank you very much Thank for you. your time, Ms. J. Yes. Much love and blessings. Absolutely. Thank you.